Yo, 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 what's good, what's good? Big fall niggas know what the fuck going on. Man, it's been a minute since the last time I seen you in front of my camera, you feel me? Man, it's been a minute, been a minute. Now that first interview we did, bro, I ain't gonna lie, I took it down. You know what I'm saying? I had took it down, and I'm gonna tell you why. You know what I'm saying? Niggas was running with the narrative that Dallas Global went locked PMG up. Ah, God. Dallas Global got PMB, they put a case on you. So what 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 what's that about, bro? Like for the people who don't know, because a lot of people was running with that. You know what I'm saying? Boom. <coughs> this had with the the interview by the trash can. I was on the run at the point. I shot that interview by the trash can. Trash can had the address on. Mm -hmm. So boom, when that video got posted, then the laws blitz. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. For sure. Long story. Short. Long story short. For sure. For sure. Now shit, bro. Like. When they when they first arrested you, cause you that's when the getaway kid shit was going on. You know what I'm saying? You was going by the getaway kid that was going up. When they hit you, like what? Walk us through that. Like what happened? Boom, Crib, boom. I was standing at the stove. Crib, posting up on Crib, smoking like I do use. Cause them hoes blitzed me so good. But it was a big ass buff nigga in an all black suit, like the nigga in Fantastics or something. On b 4 b gang, cause nigga buff like Mr. Incredible. On Crip gang, I seen that nigga, I knew that wasn't no regular nigga on Crip. That was an undercover nigga, so as I said it, nigga, all the police get the head in the corner, head in the corner, I say, fuck it. I took off running. I took off running, I dropped my gun on Crip, dropped that, and I took off running, I was gone. I was under the shed, they already slammed my little partner on this shit. I heard him get slammed, did him. Dirty, I'm crib. I stayed under the shed for some hours though. Them hoes flashed the uh, light on my feet. That's the only reason I got caught. Yeah. But I got away from them hoes. Damn, damn. Okay, so you go to jail, you come back, bro. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You signed a deal with uh, Inner Circle. Like, how did that come about? Was they reaching out to you when you went to jail or? Man, they reached out to a nigga when I had got back out of jail. Okay. That shit wasn't worth it. So like, okay, it went viral when you got signed. Like all the blogs posted it, it was going up, you know what I'm saying? But it was like niggas was pocket watching. You know what I'm saying? Like Boom. Let, let's let's keep it real now. How much, if you want to speak on it, how much did you sign for initially? 20. 20K. That gave you 20K cash. Bro, I didn't even have all my money out on the thing, bro. I just had a little something. No, they gave me 10k, but you know how the thing is. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Now, bro, I mean, shit, that's a decent deal, though. I ain't gonna lie, bro. But before I signed that deal, they I had my own money bands. So that was just adding on to what I had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what made you want to go in a circle? You know, so what made you want to go that route? Just to see what all this shit was about. Yeah. Getting signed and shit. Yeah, yeah. Now, shit. Now, you you announced that you no longer with them. Wait, wait. Uh, what made you want to go that route? What made you want to leave? Cause shit, they wasn't doing shit for me. Now, when you say they wasn't doing shit, like what was you expecting them to do? Shit, help a nigga out. Shit, what you signed me for? I mean, if shit. you ain't gonna help me with the videos, if you ain't gonna help me do nothing, nigga, what is you signing me for? I ain't gonna lie, bro. Twenty bands is shit. That's some help. Like what, what? What was you expecting, bro? To take the fuck off? Yeah. That shit slowed me down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, shit, bro. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You been dropping. You been dropping. You went viral on Dallas Global again. I posted you. You know what I'm saying? I posted you every blog after. Start posting you with Lil Rodney Mama when I posted you in the car with her. It went viral. What the hell was that about? <laughs> Man. Man, I'm beef over game. That the little nigga keep talking on crib. I'm that nigga daddy. I'm his daddy. But that's how I know how to say to anybody who want a question. I'm that nigga daddy. Bro, okay, you answer my question though. <laughs>
Alright, alright, alright. So moving forward, bro. Moving forward. Like, Lil Roddy, like, like 12, bro. Or 13. Like, a lot of people I notice in the comments, they saying, like, you beefing with a kid. Like, so why even entertain him? Man, that nigga half of my age. I ain't lying. Fuck that nigga. He half of my age. He's a kid, a child. Bro, the nigga is half of my age. See. I'm saying, bro, like, do you ever just look at it like, damn, bro, I'm really too old to even be. You know what I'm saying? Bro, ask that little nigga. Bro, that nigga know what the fuck going on with us. Nigga, let Lil Rodney make it. Him and Lil Nate, bitch ass. The white boy? Yeah, the little white boy. Him and Lil Nate, car walking late at night, red up on his legs, and piss his pants. Bro, the nigga let him make it, but like he talked too much. Like, guaranteed if a nigga see him again, the little nigga gonna get it. Nah, I don't think he's doing anything, bro. Bro, I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't jacking him up or nothing. I'm putting it on his ass. The belt, right? <laughs> he talking about the <laughs> nah, belt. Nah, Crib, I'm talking, I'm talking about, about the belt. You talking All about these the niggas belt, talking bro. about the switches, shop and came automatic. I'm blue flat, motherfucker. All right, bro, we gonna talk about the music, fam, because. Like, you really talented, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Your style different. Like, and to see you perform live, bro, it's a hell of a show. Like, when I see you perform, you had that bitch turk, like, for sure. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, when are you going to take your music 100% serious? Shit, now. What are you doing to take your music serious? Just keep talking my shit. Yeah. That's all I know how to do. I ain't even gonna lie, I got some different shit I'm finna drop. Bro, I got some shit, like, people wouldn't even know I knew how to do on some shit. Yeah, yeah I got some shit for 